welcome back to my channel and welcome back to a new video and a new haul. I've got a Zara haul for you all today and I feel like I haven't done one in the longest time. I'll be honest, for a while I just... Zara wasn't doing it for me. I felt like I was in between seasons, I was looking for pieces and it just wasn't hitting the spot. So I didn't shop on Zara for a long time but... I did a big order and so far from what I've seen from unboxing it, it looks so nice. I haven't tried anything on yet. If it fits as nice as it looks, we are in for a treat. So I hope you've all enjoyed the first week of having a little bit more freedom. We're allowed to go to beer gardens, out for outdoor dining, drinks, that vibe. So I feel like this haul, I have kind of kept that in mind. I'm just like ready for summer if I'm honest. I want to wear dresses in cute little heels and shorts so that's what I'm doing even though English weather is very temperamental however let me manifest my summer dream okay so yeah let's get straight into the video and kick off with the item I'm wearing if you guys watch my videos and watch my hauls you know that as soon as I find a nice item that I like when I unbox it I have to put it on straight away and wear it for the video because I just get too excited so this is a nice one shoulder shirt I have been looking for a shirt like this for so long, ever since Zara first released it, which I think was like last summer if I'm honest, and I could never get my hands on it. Um, I finally ordered it and I am so glad. I feel like it's the perfect jeans and a nice top. Top. Um, it's like just such a nice fit in terms of it gives you that shirt and that coverage and classy vibe, but it also feels a little bit sexier. I think it's because the shoulder's out and it's also really fitting like around your boobs and waist it is such a nice fit so I picked this up in a size small and it was 29.99 which I think is really good for a classic white shirt which you will be able to wear year on year so let me pop on an outfit style it up and show you how I would wear this out okay so is it possible to be obsessed with an outfit because I honestly just need to wear this to a beer garden let me show you honestly guys I love this shirt so much the fit is just so nice so i have just paired it with some little by the way if you see Kobe walking around he might like come in short stretch and he's like on the floor asleep anyway so i've just paired this shirt with these levi shorts and um, these are the 501 levi shorts which i actually only got this week um and the fit is lovely and then i've paired it with these <laughs> that's really not the best way to show them let me come back these little green heels which are from love red and honestly i need a green bag to match imagine a little mini green bag or even some big green chunky earrings would be a whole moment i just can't wait so i would wear something like this out to drinks cocktails brunch um like day drinks i just think it is the cutest fit ever and you best believe that after i finish filming this I am off to find myself a green bag. I feel like this top is going to become like my wardrobe staple. Like if I've got nothing to wear, I'll just throw on this top because it just feels so flattering. I feel so like, I don't know, I feel like I can move, but I'm also like very secure, which sometimes in a shirt, I don't really feel the most secure. So yeah, I love this and I like that it kind of goes like asymmetric so I could tuck it in if I wanted, but I also quite like like the tight ruched waist really cute okay next up i picked up this absolutely stunning blazer dress i'm obsessed with the quality and the color of this it is it looks like it's a skirt and a blazer tucked in to each other um but it's actually a dress all in one and it just feels the nicest quality i feel like if this fits right it's going to suck you in, in the right places and give you that flattering fit sometimes i feel with blazer dresses because they are more on the oversized side you need a belt to cinch in your waist or it can kind of make well for me personally makes me look quite square however i feel like this waistband with the skirt crossover detail is going to just be such a flattering fit I would definitely wear this for more of a dressy occasion, so dressed up with heels, a little bag for maybe cocktails, drinks, when you still want to look classy, um, and it still is quite cold outside, but you want to dress up. So it has a zip down the side to get into it, which means obviously it's going to be a lot more sculpted when you get it on. I always find when things have a side zip, when I, when I do it up, I'm like, whoa, like I feel secure, which I really like. I got it in a size small, and it was 49 99 so i will style this up and show you guys what i think of it 
all right guys so i absolutely love this on like the fit is stunning the quality is so nice but i just can't for the life of me get this zip up like jordan's tried and you know when fabrics have a big waistband and like you just can't get it past like it's not even that it's too tight like there's plenty room to do it up like more than enough um it just won't go over the zip so i'm like what do i do about that um but i absolutely love it like it's so sculpting in the right places really flattering really gorgeous quality nice length like it's beautiful um i need to just see if i can fix this situation because I can do it when it's not on my body, but when it's on my body, it's a slight issue. Um, this with just some strappy heels and a little bag would be just a really easy throw on outfit. Um, I feel like it looks really classy. It would be nice for like a meal, a date, you name it. Um, I love that this is like a really low cut, but also like really secure. Like I don't feel like my boobs are going to fall out at all. Like it's really good coverage. And the fact that it looks like it's like a blazer tucked into a skirt... I really like like Jordan even said is that a blazer and a skirt and I was like no it's a dress um so yeah really nice long sleeves with the buttons I love a long sleeve I think it makes it look more expensive and more chic um and as long as I can get this zip sorted I feel like this will be a classic like throw on for any meal type of vibe um also it's really comfortable like I could sit down and have dinner in it and not feel like it's too skin tight that I can't move or that's a bit too much so it's a nice way of wearing like a dress but also being like classy and covered up as well so yeah i really like this so the next outfit i'm going to show you is some shorts and a top one thing that i've realized when i was kind of having my big spring clear out of my wardrobe is that i don't have a lot of dressy tops hence getting this one and hence getting the one i'm about to show you I feel like i have a lot of like the zara basic body suits or plain vest tops and razor tops but actual dressy tops to wear with jeans or even like some nice tailored trousers i just didn't have so i found this asymmetric knit ribbed top it is honestly the cutest thing ever this neckline i feel like is gonna just be so flattering as you can tell i'm liking the whole asymmetric i feel like sometimes it's just nice to get your collarbones out and get a bit of skin out but still feel covered up um it's a really nice stretchy ribbed material um which is one of my favorite materials to wear actually because i feel like it just sucks you in perfectly i always size down with materials like this because i think it looks nice when it's skin tight um i really like the thin strap that goes over and it's just a nice little added detail to a plain black vest top this would look gorgeous with just plain denim jeans a black strappy heel and you'd be good to go and it's just a little bit different so I got this in a size small and it was £17.99 and it also came in like a lime green which I think would be so nice with the tan in the summer and some white shorts so if this fits nice then I will 100% be purchasing that. And then I've paired that top with these little black tailored shorts. Although they're tailored they're actually a really soft kind of linen-y style material which is perfect when it gets a little bit warmer and you don't want a thick heavy short you want to be floaty and airy and be able to breathe um so these are really really nice they've actually got a stretchy waistband at the back although they've got the tailored look at the front which again is just perfect for me comfort is key and i feel like these are going to provide it and they look like they're going to be a good length um there's nothing worse than a short which goes right up your bum and your bum comes out in public that's not what we want we're classy ladies um this definitely looks like they are gonna provide full coverage for the bum i think a black classic look like this with really nice like high quality tailored pieces just looks so nice you could even throw like an oversized blazer over them a big denim jacket and trainers to casual it down um but yeah i got these in a size small and it was 19.99 and i will show you guys how i would style these up okay i absolutely love this top on so much that that neckline this situation it's doing wonders for the boobs okay i really really like it it's really flattering it's not too long as well the top probably ends about there so it's not like super ruched under the shorts um but yeah i absolutely love it i feel like this would go with so much like even jeans um like it's just the perfect jeans and a nice top top um but yeah just a really nice alternative to a plain black top and then the shorts as well i absolutely love they look really cool i feel like really dressy um, I love the ruched at the back and also I have paired them with, Colby out the way please, 
thank you very much come on out the way i paired them with these red heels and i just feel like again it's so cute i just want a red bag to match i'm having this like moment at the minute where i just want to wear really nice colorful shoes with a matching bag look at kobe just watching me he finds it so strange when i talk to the camera um but yeah really really cute for like this time of year when it's still not super warm i'd probably throw a blazer over my shoulders um maybe like a light a nude colored one but these shorts are so nice like they're really floaty you've got loads of air um, like you'd be comfortable wearing these all day especially when it's warmer they're not going to be like up your bum when you're walking just love it and honestly the fit of this top the material of it i don't know if you can see a little bit better when i come in it's just so nice super happy and this is the shorts the waistband really flattering and tight but then because the material goes out it like sucks you in and gives you more of a silhouette love it this would be a good barbecue outfit, I feel, because like you're airy and floaty, you can like lounge around, but you also look really put together. Like I feel so comfortable and secure in this outfit, um, especially with like the little block heel. Super cute, love it, can't wait to wear it out. Next up, I have picked up one of my first summer dresses. I just couldn't help myself, if I'm honest. When I seen this on the website, I just thought that would be sensational with a tan so it is this really nice khaki olive dress it is long mid axis style again that ribbed knit really stretchy flattering material and it's actually backless so it's got these two crossover straps which go around your arms and a really low back so i was just imagining a really tanned back even just with some flat sandals in the summer i feel like it would look stunning this high neck racer style cut is my absolute favourite on tops and dresses because it's so flattering. For me personally, I have quite broad shoulders, so that racer style just sits perfectly on your collarbones and is really flattering. This is the type of dress that you could 100% dress up, wear super dressy with like some really high heels and a nice bag, but also on holiday on an evening with some flat, nice gold sandals, a nice little mini bag would also look nice. Like it's the type of dress I love a mid axi with a flat. I feel like it just looks really put together, but effortless at the same time. Um, again, the material's nice. The only thing that I have concerns about is, I don't know if you can see on camera, but there's like white marks on it and I don't know like if that that's like just the material or if it's marked i'm not too sure um but i'll have to see what it looks like when i try it on and have a look but i think the low back is just mm. beautiful so i got a size small in this and it was 29.99 okay so i just don't know about this one i don't know how i feel thing is i absolutely love the back i think the back is really nice it's really flattering. I like that it's low. Like, I think it's really sexy. Um, but the front, I just feel like there's, like, excess material. Like, if that wasn't there, I don't know. I feel like it's not that flattering. Like, that could be more, like, sculpted. I just... I don't know. Like, the neckline's really nice. You all know I love this neckline. Um, also, these little marks on it, like, are just marks. I don't know what they are, what they're doing. Do you see, like, that material doing that? Like... I just I'm unsure let me know what you think down below um I don't know whether to keep it or not I've just styled it with a little khaki bag from PLT and some yellow heels because I like khaki and yellow I think it's really cute I just don't know how I feel about it I love the length I love how it sits like with your back out and with that crossover detail I think that is lovely I just, I'm just unsure about this. Like, I'm not loving it. I feel like it's the type of dress that I'd be, like, playing around with it and pulling it down all the time. Maybe I go down a size. Maybe I try an extra small. Because then it would be more fitted, hopefully, around there. I feel like this type of dress, I want it to be, like, sculpted. And I don't know if this is. Um, but, yeah, nevertheless, the material feels really high quality. It feels, like, really thick. Um... And I like it. I, I do. I just don't know. I feel like I'd need to like try it on with flats as well. I'm undecided. Let me know your thoughts and you guys can help me decide. Next up is yet another summer dress and I just could not resist with this one. I seen this first time 
on Sarah Ashcroft's, I think it was a Zara haul or maybe like a What's New in Her Wardrobe and she looked stunning in it and I was like, that is a dress for the summer and I had to pick it up myself. So I have one really similar to this, which I got from Public Desire like two years ago and I wear it every single summer without fail. It's just a classic gold long backless floaty dress i wear it so much and when i seen this i just thought it was a nice different alternative so it's like a nice gold color with kind of like um leopard print is that leopard print yeah i'd say that's leopard print and it has long straps which you can adjust backless so you can tie it as tight as you want which i really like i like a dress where you can cinch in your waist um i talk about that all the time i just find that it's the most flattering especially for my figure uh, looks a really nice length it's just so floaty and again stuff like this same as the green dress so nice with flat sandals so nice dressed up would look gorgeous with an oversized blazer over your shoulders for like a wedding or something i just love it i think it's beautiful i feel like after the year we've had we need to just be glam so like i am gonna wear stuff like this all the time i mean i'm not going to tesco in it but best believe that i'm going to be wearing cute dresses cute little outfits i'm not wearing joggers and hoodies and gym clothes ever again as soon as we are allowed out the house so i've just found a label and this dress says a festive season which i'm slightly confused about i hope they don't mean christmas um because i think this is a summer dress personally and i just think it's going to be so nice imagine loads of highlight on your chest and your shoulders I just think this is going to be a summer staple. So I got this dress in a medium and it was $49.99. Okay, I feel like I should be walking around a vineyard with a glass of wine waiting for my husband in this dress. That is the vibe it's given me. Honestly, it feels so nice, so slinky. Um, I've just got Jordan to tie it for me. And you can obviously have it a few different ways. I think I've missed out a hoop there, but... I mean, it was very fiddly. Uh, the length is perfect. I've just got it on with some white strappy heels, but also some flat shoes would look gorgeous. Um, and I just think this would be a staple, like such a good wedding guest dress, such a good like races dress for like a dressy occasion. Um, but you still want to look like, I don't know, slinky and sexy i just love it i like the halter neck it feels very secure um you can obviously pull it as tight as you want which i really like because you can adjust if you want it more floaty if you want to like cinch it in a little bit more you always could um but yeah i really like this i think the pattern is gorgeous i am glad that i sized up to a medium um because i think a small would definitely have been too tight with dresses like this you want it to kind of just like flow off you and look really effortless if i got the small i feel like it would have been a bit more like skin tight um but yeah i really like this i feel like i will get a lot of wear out of it in the warmer months like i said with a blazer over your shoulder it would also look gorgeous and i like it a lot i can't wait to wear this on holiday eating paella with a glass of sangria i think wearing this dress i would definitely wear my hair in like a sleek bun or something um because i think the dress is a lot that um it doesn't need like you know big hair but really nice really good fit fits in the right places and i really like it i have been on the hunt for the perfect mom jean for what feels like my whole entire life um i have some levi's that were actually vintage and they're just kind of they're past their day the badge on the back is like hanging off and the fit's gone a bit rubbish so i've been looking for some mom jeans and i see so many people talk about zara mom jeans and i've never actually had them so i picked some up and the color of this denim is my absolute favorite like this kind of washed really light denim it's just my favorite color i don't really like dark denim and i don't really like acid what i and I don't really like acid washes. I just don't really suit them, I don't think. Um, but this style is gorgeous. I love this Zara badge on the back. I've got them in a size. Where is the size on these then? Size 10. So I was in a bit of a predicament whether to size up. Hopefully these fit nice. Please God. Jeans, I'm a bit hit and miss with. I do feel like a lot of the time I have to get them altered. Um, but I got a size 10 because I just thought an 8 wouldn't probably get over my bum. Um, and looking at them, I think they look like they're going to be a very good fit. So these are the classic mom fit high rise ankle length. And 
if these fit then they're going to be my new favorite jean that's all i can say in terms of styling these up i mean actually honestly denim in a white shirt just does something to me don't you think that the color of denim with a white shirt just looks so nice um so maybe i'll style these with this top for a more dressy look um but equally like i just wear denim jeans with everything with bodysuits hoodies jumpers you name it also i love a strappy heel with a mom jean i just think it looks so flattering especially when the jean fits nice and it's tight around your waist but a baggier leg i just think it's such a nice look so i'm super excited to try these guys i found the perfect mom jean we've done it honestly i am so impressed with these jeans they are the nicest fit ever like let me just come in close okay look at this waist to bum ratio it's actually tight and fitted around your waist they're never usually tight and fitted around your waist really nice sucks you in super high waisted nice and fitted on your legs but also has that mom straight leg <laughs> Kobe likes them straight leg feel so I've just styled it with the black bodysuit which I showed you earlier um it's not a bodysuit it's a top so I've got some classic black heels on and a little black bag and you'd be good to go you could throw over a leather jacket throw over a big black blazer and it's such an easy look i'm just so happy with the fit of these jeans i don't know if i said on the other clip but they are only 27.99 like that is so good for some mom jeans and i feel like they look good so on the website as well they had these jeans in like loads of different colors they had a black and a white so i'm thinking a white jean could be so nice and i've also been looking for ages for a good classic black jean that fits nice so i feel like this is going to be them next item i picked up is some classic white tailored shorts these are definitely thicker and more of like a tailored material than the black ones i showed you um these are called the high rise short and again i just thought when it gets a little bit warmer these are really really nice to style up for like meals drinks you name it when you don't want to wear denim i actually used to have a pair of shorts very similar to this um, and i'd wear it with like oversized t-shirts and chunky trainers and it just felt like you were wearing something a little bit more dressy um even for a casual outfit i got these in a size small and they were 27.99 i also think these came in a few different colors as well so if the fit's good it would be a really good wardrobe staple again i feel like they'd look nice with this top maybe i'm just obsessed with this top so i think everything in the world would go with it however i have just paired it with this bodysuit so this is one of the zara classic bodysuits which i have in every color they've ever released i think apart from the leopard print because i wasn't a fan of that one um i don't know if this is still online because sometimes the colors come in and out of stock but i'm pretty sure that plt and a couple of other websites i'm sure do really good dupes of these tops i will try and link a few similar down below um, but this is just the classic racer bodysuit. These are my life. Like, I wear these more than any other top in the world. They're just the most flattering fit. They're so nice. They're so seamless. You don't have to wear a bra because they're double lined underneath. And they're the most comfortable bodysuit in the world. They're super cheap as well. I think they're like £12. Um, and I highly recommend investing, especially in the black and white, because I get so much wear out of them. If I ever don't know what to wear, one of the black bodysuits with some jeans it's just a classic i always get these bodysuits in a size small and i'm like an 8 slash 10 um, and i feel like they're a really nice tight like sucked in fit so yeah let me try this outfit on and i'll let you know my thoughts i really don't want to say i'm obsessed with every single outfit but i'm obsessed with every single outfit in this haul i'm so happy i've never had such a successful zara haul so these are the white shorts on they are so nice they're a little bit big on the waist but nothing that like a bit of tailoring won't sort out and i don't know if it's even that bad if i'm honest like i really actually quite like the way they fit they're a really good length on your bum your bum cheek is not going to be hanging out um and just really flattering they've got the pockets i really like them again with a tan it looks lovely this is the bodysuit so you can really see the fit of them as you can see it's just so flattering i haven't got a bra on right now they're just like a wardrobe staple honestly you need to invest in them if you get anything from this haul go and get the bodysuits in every single color so i've just paired this outfit with some little blue heels i'll link like everything from the outfits down below as well do not worry and then this zara pillow bag which i actually got last year 
um, but I still love it. It's still a classic. I feel like it's a love or hate thing, but I think it's cute. I mean, I think it goes well with the outfit. This, again, I am aware, by the way, that all of these outfits are pretty summery. Um, but your girl likes to be prepared and listen. It's going to get warmer soon. It really is. So I don't really care. However, this outfit as well with an oversized white blazer or an oversized nude blazer would look really, really nice. Actually, a white blazer would look gorgeous because it would look like a matching set. Um, but yeah, absolutely love this. Again, it's 10 out of 10 from me. And um, yeah, I think I'm definitely going to get these shorts in the other colours because feel like I would get so much wear out of these in the summer. They're just super flattering because they've got this big waistband with the zip. They really do cinch in your waist in the right places. Really, really like it. Next up, we've got a classic wardrobe staple for spring and summer. And it's just an oversized blue shirt. I feel like everyone just needs one of these. They are the best for layering and just having a different element to an outfit so i wear these over the white zara bodysuit some shorts jeans just anything i feel like it's such a nice way of wearing something that makes you feel a little bit more covered up when it's not like super warm but also not a super heavy coat i think this one was actually advertised as a dress because it is really really long but i like a long shirt as you all know if it covers your bum it gets a tick from me um but i got it in a size medium and it is 19.99 i feel like i'll just get so much wear out of this i would also wear this as a dress so unbutton it maybe a nice little white lace bralette underneath some white strappy heels mini white bag and it's a really easy effortless look that you can just throw on in two minutes and you're not going to be bothered about like sucking in or being bloated or fiddling around with the outfit it just sits nice um but i'll probably wear this the most open with like crop tops underneath even joggers like tucked into joggers or with joggers and a top I'm literally listing every single outfit you could have with this shirt because there's just so many i feel like it's a wardrobe classic Alrighty, blue shirt i've gone for full zara look so i've got the white shorts on which i showed you previously i've got the white bodysuit um the classic one this is white and i haven't got a bra on and as you can see it is not see-through um and then the shirt is just a really nice layer to add on top i feel like this like kind of casuals it down a little bit um and makes it more like daytime obviously the heels are dressy but like daytime brunch bottomless brunch vibes that's kind of the look. Um, so I've just paired it with some white strappy heels and a little white bag, which is from So Monroe. Um, and I feel like blue and white just looks so nice. So like a full white look with the shirt looks really crisp, really classy, and I love it. So as you can see, the shirt is definitely long enough to wear as a dress with nothing underneath. Um, like I'd be comfortable doing that, but I really like the length of it. I think it's a lot more statement when it's this long. Um, and I feel like I'll just get so much wear out of this. I'll wear it with jeans, I'll wear it with crop tops. Um, also like with chunky trainers, it would be really nice. So I'm really happy with this. I'm glad I got a size medium because I think the oversized look is better. Really like the cuffed sleeves. It kind of looks like you're wearing your boyfriend's shirt or your dad's shirt, which I think is just a really nice look. The material's a lot thicker than my other blue shirts that I've got. It is kind of like an actual like men's work shirt which I just think's nice, like it makes it feel a lot more expensive, a lot higher quality. Um, and yeah, actually this done up with the white heels would be really nice as well. Like I said, a shirt like this, you're just gonna get so much wear out of. Um, I would even throw it over like some gym leggings and a black top. It's just very versatile. And finally, I picked up another shirt because again, they're just what I'm gravitating towards at the minute. I don't think you can beat a nice pair of joggers or a nice pair of jeans, a little white crop top and an open shirt. I just think it looks so nice. The reason I actually picked this up is because Hayley Bieber recently wore an outfit, I'll insert it here, and I was like, that is just stunning. So I felt the need to try and recreate the look, although I need to get some black cargo trousers to match. But this shirt I just thought was very similar, oversized, really nice camel colour. Um, I'd wear this the exact same way that I would have wore the blue. I could wear it as a dress, with oh do you know what this with some brown heels a little brown bag would be amazing you could even belt it in you could wear it open with joggers you could wear it open with joggers underneath i just feel like it's 
there's endless amounts of things you can do with these shirts. I actually got this one in a size small and it was $19.99. And similar to the blue, I think this was advertised as a dress. I don't think they're exactly the same, um, but they're pretty similar. This is definitely a thinner material, um, so it's definitely not going to be as thick and warm. But this colour I just thought was gorgeous and I didn't own one that was this shade. So I'm very excited to wear this. Shirts like this I also think look lovely like draped off your shoulder. Um, like I said a little bralette underneath. It's just a nice way of covering up but also feeling like a little bit sexy as well at the same time. Okay I'm looking very safari chic and I'm not mad about it. I'm not going to apologise for it. I really love the colour of this shirt. I feel like I'll get a lot of wear out of this. With my wardrobe, which is very like neutrals, blacks and whites, I feel like this will just go over things really nicely. Um, the exact same fit, obviously, as the blue ones. It's got the nice cuff details and like the boyfriend kind of fit. If I was wearing it as a dress, I'd definitely like drape it off the shoulder. Maybe add like some big gold chunky jewellery. Um, I just like the green with it. I thought the colours looked nice. Again, a matching bag would have made the outfit and I'm definitely going to order one. Um, but yeah, I really like this. I feel like this is the type of shirt that I'd throw on over joggers and t-shirt because it's just like a little bit more muted and understated um, that just to throw it on would be such an easy look. Um, as a dress, I don't know if it's just a bit too oversized, like maybe that I'd need to like belt it in. I don't know. But nevertheless, I love the colour. I love the oversized fit of it and it will definitely get a lot of wear. And that is everything from today's haul, guys. I really hope you enjoyed it. As always, everything will be linked down below in the description. Make sure to like, comment and subscribe if you did enjoy it. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.